At the heart of GI questions is the skill of data interpretation. To ace GI questions, you need to become adept at interpreting information that is displayed to you in varied graphical forms from line and bar charts to pie charts and scatter plots. Complementing this is another very critical skill, analytical reasoning. GI questions often require you to draw logical inferences from the data that's presented to you and that could involve discerning trends, identifying patterns or even pinpointing anomalies. Now, GI questions present information to you in two ways. One is the textual, which is there in the question scenario and the question statement. And second, obviously, is the visual information that's presented to you through the chart. Now, the combination of this textual and visual information requires you to show your comprehension skills, right? Now, your comprehension skills as it pertains to textual information are what you build when you prepare for verbal section, which is why we recommend that students begin with their data insights preparation only after they have achieved the required proficiency level in the verbal section. Now, GI questions rarely involve any intricate calculations, even though the calculator has been provided to you. Quantitative reasoning, on the other hand, is absolutely paramount to how you perform on GI questions. You'll need to grasp the quantitative facets of the data, such as percent changes, ratio comparisons, statistical elements, and so on and so forth. And all these skills are honed when you prepare for the quantitative section, which is another reason why we suggest attempting data insight section preparation only after you have gained satisfactory quantitative proficiency level. And then there is the critical thinking component of these GI questions. Now, there are certain GI questions that will challenge you to evaluate arguments or claims based on the data presented, again, with the goal to gauge your ability to critically assess information and form sound judgments. Now, if you put it all together, your data interpretation skills, your analytical reasoning skills, your comprehension skills, your critical thinking, quantitative reasoning, if you put together all these, you will understand that these skills are vital not only for excelling in the test, but also in all the fields in which data interpretation and analysis are integral to sound decision making process. So when you are in the process of building these skills as you go through the course here, understand that the skills that you're going to acquire here will extend far beyond the scope of the test itself.